Hi, my name is Cesar Saavedra and I'm a Technical Marketing Manager at GitLab. GitLab 13.9 has a new feature called Markdown Links for Feature Flags, which introduces a new special reference to our GitLab Flavor Markdown for Feature Flags. When you use this reference anywhere in your Issues or Merge Requests Markdown, GitLab will replace it with a link to the feature flag you specified in the reference. Not only does this improve collaboration on feature flags, but it also streamlines the stakeholders' DevOps work. Let's see how this new feature works. Here we see the release announcement and for this specific feature, Markdown links for feature flags. If you click on the documentation button, it will open up a new tab and it'll take you to the page in the documentation that describes this new feature. And there you see that's a special reference new in this release called a feature flag it shows, it shows you the syntax on how to use it so now let's see how to use this new reference in an issue inside a project here called prog manager spring in this project i have two feature flags one is called prods in alpha order and notice that the percent rollout for the production environment is 50 percent and I have another feature flag called brand name in caps. Let's go to the issues and create a new issue. Let's assume that we want to update the first feature flag that you saw, and we're going to request to adjust the feature flag to a uh, hundred percent uh, deployment to production. In other words, we're going to, make a change to that feature flag so that the feature appears in all of the production pods. We enter a title for the issue and then we enter a short description. I will go ahead and assign the issue to myself and then I will go ahead and click on submit issue to create it. So once it's created, um, I could have added the reference in the description itself of this issue, but I choosing to add it in the comments Let's just assume that I forgot to include that link. So I'm adding it in the comment. I could have edited the description and added there too. So I'm just putting in here, the feature flag definition can be found at, and then I'm going to go ahead and use the new feature uh, reference. And I'm entering here the feature flag reference and uh, markdown and I'm uh, going to specify that it's the feature flag number one. Notice that when I save the comment, that becomes a link. And when you click on the link, it takes you directly to the feature flag so that uh, work can be done, not necessarily by me, but by someone else. And they can go ahead and update uh, the feature flag, for example, in this case, to 100% rollout in production. That's it. Thank you very much for watching.